As we already learned, there are some general symptoms such as losing weight for no reason, tiredness, low-grade fevers, usually over a few months, but in this disease, it can also happen a little bit more suddenly. And in these patients, it will affect the aorta and its branches. Now, the aorta is one of the largest blood vessels that comes out of the heart and then kind of curls over and goes to the rest of the body. So the largest blood vessels are sent to the head and then to the arms and to the legs. So these patients will get superficial headaches, They'll get tenderness of the temporal artery, which is right here. They can get blurry vision or sudden blindness for a second that comes and goes. They can get jaw claudication or tiredness with chewing their food, and they can get stiffness and pain of the shoulders and the hips. This disease, even though it's considered one of the most common primary vasculitis of adults, is actually still pretty rare. You would need about 10,000 people in a room above the age of 50, because this is a disease that attacks patients above the age of 50, you would need 10,000 of them in a room for even one person to have it. It is more common in women, and it is more common in those who are white of Northern European descent. 